Well, one of the things I've been enjoying in this season, I don't know about you, is going for some extra walks. Maybe you've done that too. You know, I'm blessed. I have this woods not far behind my house and this paint branch trail that so many people use. And you know, one of the things out here in these woods and on this trail, things pretty much stay the same out here. You know, let's face it, we're still dealing with a lot of change, it seems, every day. And while I'm optimistic about the future, there's still a lot of uncertainty in our world. But out here, there's just so much that I can count on no matter what. There's things out here that are the same every morning, every walk. You know, as I think about this spot here, we were here on Easter Sunday for our a kind of spontaneous sunrise service and you know the sun came up uh, just behind me right when we were starting because the sun rises out here no matter what the stream flows out here water comes under this bridge all the time no matter what there's rocks out here in the stream that I like to sit on a couple especially that don't move no matter what there's trees that are blossoming still, these red bud trees with these purple blossoms on them right now. And that's happening no matter what. But my favorite is the birds. The birds still sing their song every morning. Now there's things out here that no restrictions can stop. You can't shut them down. They're not gonna change. And it brings comfort to our hearts, but as I think about that, my heart is also moved to remember just how many certain realities I have in my life because of Jesus. Well, what do I mean by that? I mean that because of the work of Christ, there's good news that is true in our lives for all time. Now, I see that throughout the New Testament but nowhere is it more obvious than in the letter of Paul to the brothers and sisters at Philippi, the book of the Bible that we call Philippians. You know, in this book of Philippians, it's kind of like a walk through the woods of all the present realities that are true in Christ. My heart's been so comforted to discover one after another, you know, even recently. Sometimes we think a lot and talk a lot about promises that are true in the scriptures about the future, and I praise God for that. There are plenty of those, but there are also present realities that the scriptures reveal that we wake up to every day. Good news that is true in our lives at all times. Realities like the fact that we're together because of Christ. We have joy and peace no matter what. We have purpose no matter what. The gospel is advancing no matter what. We can move toward Christ no matter what every single day. Now that's just truth that we need to hear and Philippians is full of it. And so I want to encourage you, join me starting this Sunday for nine Sundays on our live stream at 4c.org slash live. We will be in the book of Philippians looking at this good news for all time plan to join us, plan to invite others. Let's go on a walk together and be comforted by all of these gospel truths that are present realities and certainties for us.